What is going on? This is Sam Kunal from Sam Fit. Checking in with you guys. You guys are doing well, doing terrific. And we are back with another video. So today's video is going to be a full day of eating. I haven't done this in a while. So I thought, hey, what a perfect time to bring that to you while running 14 miles. So before we eat, we're going to earn <laughs> the calories that we are about to eat. So uh, in case you don't know, I, I mean, I will keep uh, talking about this. I am training for the Austin Marathon in February 19. So we are about 79 days out today. Shit is getting real. And... Uh, 14 miles. So I've done 14 miles before prior to training. Um, I had to obviously pull out. Uh, pause. Um, I had to pull out because <laughs> I had an ITV uh, issue. So, but we are back on training. Uh, legs feeling better and we are going to be knocking that out. Hell is shameless. Necklace on me decorated. Feeling it, man. It's getting turned. All right, so before the run, of course, um, you have to get some calories and just to make sure you are going to be fishing and you have enough energy and you're running. That's a no-brainer. So today, this morning already, I've already had 1,600 calories. Uh, some two English muffins, two servings of peanut butter, a uh, large banana, um, and I'll wash that down with a G1M Sport, which has 40 grams of carbs in it. So while I'm running, I'm going to be having this bad boys uh one human gel every 30 minutes it's got 25 uh grams of carbs in each also uh, i have three of those and i also have the martine gel in my opinion maybe not the greatest tasting or one of the most efficient just because it has 100 milligrams of caffeine just a little pick me up 25 grams of carbs also and i have two more g1m sports in here and some electrolytes in it i'll be sipping while i run so in total this morning i'm already at 1600 calories that's some of y'all's daily caloric intake especially if you're in a cut so i don't know exactly what the calorie is going to be whatever the calorie that we are going to be consuming today that's what's going to be on the title of the video so you can know what to expect as we get into this video and max no i like to stall on this long runs <laughs> By, ch by chatting a lot, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> but. You're not gonna do that? <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I'll try not to do that. And we're about to get after this run. Again, just to show you guys again, I will keep harping a lot on this. This shit is not easy for me. Uh, it's not, oh yeah, I'm just gonna show up in casual for 14 miles. No, it's a struggle. Like mentally struggle, physical struggle, struggling. So I will, I refuse to give you an easy way out. Like, oh yeah, sandwiches on it because it's easy. No, this shit is hard, but. That's part of the fun, that's part of the challenge. When we finish, it's gonna feel good. The food is even gonna taste better. He's going to drop the kids off, for those of you that want to know. So one of the secrets to staying warm in the cold while you're running, Tiger Mom. I learned that from a football player. Run begins, see you soon. Eleven ninety-two uh, miles in into the forty-mile run. This was on Instagram uh, last week, two weeks ago, when I was doing my thirty-mile run on my half, and I want to share this with my YouTube family. So the spot that you see right here, if you go back to previous video, uh, when I quit, I mentioned I was training for a, a full marathon, and I had to stop because uh, my TV was just flaring up. I just couldn't go anymore. This right here is a spot that I quit. Well, my body just said no i had enough at 18.2 miles right here and since then it's been a struggle to get back and i mean to the point like when we got that running half a mile was a struggle without any pain and to be 12 miles in and right this fucking spot is something that will always mean a lot to me i will always have gratitude for because uh your boy was kind of hurting mentally because man i know i'm capable of it but my body is just saying no so anytime i get to this spot I'm gonna give you a nice little dab, just a nice little appreciation for making it past this point. How are you feeling? Ah, uh, you know. 
total 14 miles finishing two hours and 14 minutes and an average pace of 9.34 feel good feel good and again this is not the longest run i ran like i said previously i ran uh, 18 miles that's when i lost the fact the longest run i ran 18.3 when i got hurt but to be back here running again 14 it's never going to be taken for granted food bring out the lobster Running is over, not the fun part, we get to eat. And one of the things that, the last time Max and I came out here, um, we came to this uh, specific spot, and I have a confession also, I came to this specific spot yesterday, and I'm back here again today. And uh, I'll just show you. Let's go. Niggas ain't really who they say on the outside. You gotta be who you really be, shine from the inside. Sausage um, and gravy. Sausage and gravy. And I blame this on Max Chudin, by the way. I saw Max have it on his channel, and I'm like, bro, what is that? I gotta have it. Now, uh, they take all my money. You grab yours? I think this is one of mine. Mm -hmm. Yep. Which one do you want? Do you got uh, This is a St. Louis pizza. And uh, I'm gonna try the turkey dressing. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. I'm so warm and good. <laughs> so the turkey is almost like Thanksgiving. Buffalo dressing. Oh, that's good. Bro, happy place. Mm -hmm. How many kolaches did you have yesterday? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> I'm ashamed. I run all the miles just to have as much kolaches as possible. This is what I said earlier. It's 100% true. Sausage and gravy. Oh my god, so warm and hot. Philly cheesesteak. Beauty. What you're saying is, you're ready to start running some more, right? True, true, true. Yeah, if this is part of it, I'm down. But you can smell that Philly cheesesteak. It's so good. Dude, it is so good. In terms of calories, especially post run, I don't have a set calories. But what I do try to prioritize is protein also, just like any other day. Um, I try to get at least about 200 grams of protein in, which puts me around a gram for like lean body mass. As long as I cover that base, I don't really care about what the macros typically lie. So again, I'll put the calories on the screen for you guys as the day goes by, just to show you guys exactly what a total amount of calories that I do. Alrighty. <clears throat> All right. Massive shout out to him. Um, again, massive shout out to him. If you don't follow me on YouTube, you should definitely do. Um, it's been helping me just like, you know, I mean, it's not just helping me like capture, uh, you know, this footage for you guys. Then I look forward to it. <laughs> it's like, you know, it's almost like you just running. It's like, hey, I'm looking forward to Max, to see Max when I got when I get there. So a little, a little pep in my step when I'm running. So it's nice to have that instead of just, you know, running circles and shit. So if you don't follow him, follow him on Instagram, follow him on YouTube. I mean, again, if you're younger, uh, individual it's easy for you to see somebody like me and be like man you're saying that because I'm uh, gifted or whatever and he's younger guy that started I mean see his before and after pictures of when he first started to where he is now you excuse me you would know exactly where you started from hopefully that can you know give you some um, encouragement to follow his channel because it documents on this journey too
morning, so this is the next day. Um, I was not able to film uh, the last part of the meal that I ate yesterday, uh, just because I want to sit down with the wife and just you know enjoy a nice dinner. But what we had last night to finish the day off was an order from Panda Express. So I got the triple uh, entree, the big plate, which came down to around 1,600 calories, which I put the total calories from yesterday on the screen for you guys. So overall, um, had about 5,000 calories. So this kid's in the background playing because hey, this is real life, man. Had about 5,000 calories. Again, the goal of my full day of eating is not to just see how much food I can gorge into my pipe hole. Goal is again to um, you know make sure I am getting as much calories in as possible. My Garmin is telling me that like you know expended about 2,000 calories. Is that 100% accurate? Not really. But again, I'm sure I am in that range. I mean, after all, I did run 14 miles, and it does expend a lot of calories. So other than all the I mean different modalities like what I'm standing next to ice barrel which I'll be getting into later other than that um, you know yes this is important but at the same time at the core of everything else all uh, calories is important just like if you're in a caloric deficit regardless of what you do you can do ice bath you can do cold therapy heat therapy it doesn't mean you're uh, you are gonna be able to recover properly because you are just in a caloric deficit so everything starts with nutrition and uh, making sure I get enough calories in protein was relatively high for the most part but overall calories matter for me on that day so today I'm gonna to be going to the gym going to train but again it's a short quick video guide for you guys uh, to try to prioritize as much protein as possible again it's not like oh yeah, I'm trying to do a challenge to eat 10,000 calories just trying to give you an idea of basic how I kind of just go about my day I focus on protein I focus on calories and I don't stress about anything else so for the guys enjoyed that uh, nice video um, again I will like to you know keep sharing as much uh, video and content for you guys as much as possible if you keep liking this video if you keep enjoying this video uh, you know let me know i will definitely keep this coming up for you guys again we are officially today as at the end of this recording we are 77 days out from the austin marathon feel good my leg is still kind of just like sore but i'm glad you know i was able to achieve that it will keep piling on mileage that is the video for you guys today hope you guys enjoyed the video if you do give this video a thumbs up share with your friends sam can also get fit and i'll see you guys in the next one peace